Hi everybody, welcome back to Life with Anita. I'm so happy you're back to join me in another video. Today we're going to be talking about self-care. Um, on Sundays I like to do a little bit of self-care and I thought I would share with you some ideas that I have and also comment below too as I'm going along. I'd love to hear what things you do for some self-care. If you like these kind of videos, give me a big thumbs up and don't forget to click the subscribe button below so that you don't miss another video. So let's get started. So I have my list of notes whoops, behind me here of some things I want to share with you. And then I also have a couple of things that I use to go over some things that I do for self-care on a Sunday just to help me recharge myself for the work week. The first thing I like to do is enjoy a nice warm beverage. So right here I have a matcha latte. I'll give it a sip. And I like to do that or have whatever kind of drink you like to do. I don't know about you, but a warm drink always makes me feel cozy. And I just love the feeling of warm teas or lattes, whatever you choose, do what makes you happy. Self-care is all about you. If you don't care to take care of yourself, how do you think you're gonna take care of others in your life or things around you that are going on? So another thing that I like to do is get outside. As you can see, I'm outside right now. Uh, you might hear my air conditioner going because it's a little warm out and I apologize if you do. But get outside. The sun is so important. The vitamin D makes you happy and it makes such a difference in your, in your day and always. What else you can do? You can just do nothing. Just relax and do nothing. If you've had a busy, stressful work week, just chill. Don't do anything and don't feel bad about doing nothing. Sometimes you just need to recharge your battery. And doing nothing might be that key that you have to do. Um, another thing you can do, sorry I have my list and I'm looking down at it. Another thing you can do is face masks. So I have a couple of different ones here. So you could do like sheet face masks if you're into that. Um, I have this one that comes like in a jar with a little spatula that I put on. I do this on Sundays. Um, you could do lip masks. Um, you could do, I know there's like ones for your hands and one for your feet. Do whatever you want. Um, you can take bubble baths. I'm a big fan of bubble baths. So I have bath bombs that I love to use. I love to use Miss um, Dr. Teal's, sorry, I have it right here. So I have a bubble bath I like to use and also um, salts. So I have a bag of salts here. I love this stuff. This one's really nice because it's like for nighttime and it helps you sleep. So you can do bath salts. You're not into baths, take a shower. There's so many things you can do for a shower. You can do like a body scrub in the shower. I know there's people that put uh, like hang eucalyptus on the shower heads, set the mood, put some music on, dim the lights, light some candles. Do what makes you happy. That's all that's important for self care. You can also, we like to do clean sheet Sunday. So actually at this moment, it's Sunday and our sheets are being washed. There's something about getting into bed and with clean sheets that's like, the best feeling ever. Read a book. I'm a big reader. Pick what you like to do. I actually have two books on the go right now. So this is like my nonfiction, my um, like not self-help book, but my nonfiction book. And then I like fiction books too. I'll grab my book and I'll go read in the bath. I do that a lot with my face mask on. Um, you can clean. I like to give the house a nice clean on Sundays. Um, sometimes I clean when I'm stressed out. It's all about you. If your environment's cluttered, I feel cluttered. So I like to clean up uh, to kind of set myself up and refresh myself. Um, watch something on TV. Watch a show on Netflix. Watch a movie that you like. Cozy up on the couch with it. Chat with friends and family. Don't just text them. Pick up the phone and call them. Or go out and meet them. Do something with your friends on a Sunday. Catch up on people that you miss that you haven't seen all week. That can always lift your spirits in so many different ways. Do your nails. I like to sometimes, I took off my nail polish actually to do my nails. I like to kind of put a simple polish on, maybe something fun. There's so many things you can do. Cook your favorite meal. Have a comfort meal. I know on Sundays we like to do a nice dinner to kind of just like take some time for us and chat with each other. Um, light candles. I actually just did this before I, 
I have all my senses going because I'm ready to change the smells out. And for me, a nice smelling home is just comforting and it's just a great feeling. Um, write in a journal. That's something actually, you can hear me. <laughs> that is actually something that I'm starting to do. It's like a gratitude journal of all the things I'm grateful for in my life. So that's just a couple of things that I like to do that kind of help me in my self-care. Because self-care I've learned is so important for me. If I don't do those things, I don't feel happy. So I want to hear from you. Let me know below. Comment. Tell me some things that you do for self-care that really help you just recharge your battery for the work week. So that's it for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed it. I'd love to hear from you like I've always told you. Comment, like, subscribe, share, do all of the YouTube things. I can't wait to talk to you all in my next video. I love you all and we'll see you soon. Bye.